Yeah, so, um, you know, Joe, when we talked a month or so ago about this um, COVID-30 idea that you had, I uh, thought it was a great idea. And uh, this particular lecture uh, really is a platform for my lecture tomorrow, which is going to be more, um, more than just basic ECMO. It's going to be some pretty serious problem solving, some hybrid cannulations, and, and why do we do these different cannulations? So anybody who uh, is very experienced in ECMO could get a nice review today. But anybody who's sort of new or you feel like maybe you could use a review or you not do very many ECMO, this, this lecture today is really going to catch all with a giant net. No matter how um, uh, basic your information might be about ECMO, we're going to kind of rope it in and then go up from there. Um, and so we call it, I call it basic strategies. I'm going to start off with sort of what ECMO is and just build up from there because you can't really appreciate why we're cannulating the way we're cannulating if you don't understand what it is we're trying to do. So uh, that was sort of the premise of today's lecture. So um, this is the title and as you know I don't have any anything to disclose on this topic. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we can go good. on from there. And so basically what we're going to be covering today uh, the name of the uh, the name of the lecture is ECMO cannulation basic strategies. But we're gonna we're gonna ask what is ECMO. We're gonna say to uh, you know look at all the indications and contraindications or at least a good good number of the major ones. Then we're gonna talk about how cannulas are inserted. Go over that briefly. Then we're gonna focus on VV ECMO and the uh, the indications and um, and the contraindications. But we're gonna look at the role and strategies of why we cannulate uh, the way we do. And then we're gonna look at the advantages and the disadvantages of each of each one of those. And then we're gonna do the same thing for VA ECMO. We're gonna look at the role and strategies for veno-arterial cannulation, the advantages and pitfalls there. And um, what's after that, Joe? Oh, sorry. And so, yeah, yeah and just so yell at me, next slide, Joe, well, next slide. Mm -hmm. That's fine, yeah, you're, you're doing great. Uh, that, so today's uh, lecture, is, and I put the date there so that you would realize if you watch this in the future and you're playing it back, that today's lecture is really a nice platform for going into a lot more detail tomorrow, but the tomorrow's lecture is gonna be how do we optimize what we're doing? It's not simply problem solving and the same thing that you've seen, uh, but what, what we're gonna talk about tomorrow is making changes and adjustments to the basic ECMO strategies we're going to talk about today and how do we optimize our care and I think that's going to really touch a lot of nice uh, 